Ah, a little beetle. He's attacking my tripod. Hi. Why you got me like that? So, only three things on the agenda today. I gotta finish up a little freelance programming project. Work on a business I'm participating in. The third is to get a workout in this afternoon. I'm trying to capture a normal day from the standpoint of documenting for myself and for this moment in time, you know, what this meant for me. I have my normal workflow, get up, do my yoga warm up, a little bit of meditation, come make my latte, and then I get cranking. <laughs> So, taking a break from the programming, making my second latte. Yikes, it's about to finish. Uh, so yeah, latte number two. When the milk just about burns my fingers, we're good. Oh, we run out of steam. Okay, so back to programming. Anyway, it's kind of fun when it all comes together, but time for a run and there may be a gorgeous sunset. Time to find out. Save this. Hey, how's it going? I'm doing pretty well. Leaving for the foothills, gonna go for a little run. Oh, was that right? I'm here, and yes, it is windy. I hope there's not lightning. Good talking to you, too. Bye. Those afternoons where it could be a storm or just a quick little shower and then it clears right up. It's actually gorgeous right now. So the 
question is if my calf is going to cramp up. And when I used to run it with a cross country team in the summers around here, I remember one of the guys telling me, when you're going uphill, you shorten up your stride and run on your toes or the balls of your feet. But I may have taken that to an extreme over the years and never worried about it, but all of a sudden I'm paying for it. And it just cramps up on me without any warning. So the last couple of times I've run, I've just been running, striking with the heel first as you normally would, even on the inclines and just powering through with my, my butt and my legs. So that seems to have worked. And that's what I meant about striking with the heel as I run uphill. So I hope that's the proper way to do it because that's the way I'm going to do it from now on. time lapse of that. That was an amazing sunset. The only other concern I have is making it back to the car in time. They closed this parking lot to this trailhead at nine. So we'll see I'm still about halfway out. Last one. Oh, yeah. Not too bad. Wind never let up. They have eleven minutes to spare.